I'm in the big leagues, Tony don't miss me. Ballin' like Houston, hey, feeling like Whitney. I need a bag, bruh. Send it too quickly. Hey, Coach Johnson, this is uh, Ace with the USFL Network. Thank you so much for. Hey, what's up? Hey, how you doing, my brother? I am doing great. Thank you for taking my call. Yes, yes. All right, so I was told I have three questions, and I have three questions ready for you. Okay. So my first question is, this is your first time jumping into the spring football world, and I wanted to know from your point of view, how has it been so far? Oh, man, it's been awesome. It's fantastic. You know, when you're in these leagues, you never know what to expect. I love the facility. Everybody's been so helpful. I, I'm, I'm getting my man Andy and Ray. All these spring football league guys are educating me about the game and, and Bob. So, I mean, it's, it's been really, really rewarding. I'm, I'm, I was tired of sitting on my couch, man, but, but this, is, this is exciting. Has it been kind of fast paced? Yeah, you know what? It's, it's, it's fast paced, but I like fast paced. Here, here's the deal. Guys not sitting around, they're not doing much. What they're doing is they're getting the meetings, they're getting them in the mail rooms, they're doing all those things. And, and, and once they get done with those things, they, they, they're on their own. They, they go to the rooms or, you know, study their play. So it's been, it's been pretty rewarding. I, I like the pace of it. I love it. My second question was you jumped into this team and you know, all of the players were already there. It was right before camp. What disadvantages or advantages are there to coming in and having a full roster already? The, the, the best thing for, about, for me was was that my, I, I don't know anyone. You know, so okay. there's no faith. There's no one's, it's a clean slate. Everyone has a clean slate. So anybody who comes in here, and half of those guys, I don't know their names. I don't know what's going on. I'm saying I do, but... But, but, but so now, for me, it's a blind evaluation. I think that's good. That's what a team like this needs. We only won three games last year. And sometimes I, I got a different view from a lot of other guys because, hey, they, they got some personal relationships and things like that. But for me, it's just I'm just coming in and I'm asking the questions. Can this guy do this? Can this one do this or whatever? And so for me, I think it's really it's, I think I like the challenge. I really do. I didn't even think about that. It's just a clean slate, and you really do get just a fresh look at every single player on the team. Yep. Yep. Oh, that is awesome. Uh, and then the third question, because I don't want to take up too much of your day, Coach. Uh, wow. My third question is, which game and head coach are you most looking forward to playing against this season? Uh, you know what? I don't, I, don't, I don't know if I have a game yet or a head coach yet. See, here's the problem. I know all these guys, all of them, most of them I've worked in NFL or competed against before. I, I, I'm just right now, currently I'm just looking at man, our team and trying to figure out who's the, who's the best quarterback, who's the best, who's, who's, who's how, what I'm going to do with these running backs in these packages and who's these receivers I'm going to do in these packages. So so more of that, I know Todd Haley, I mean, he's, he's here with me and, and, you know, he's a good guy and, you know, his father passed, so. So he's, you know, been, been around him somewhat. He's a good guy and everything. So no one in particular, you know, most of these guys I know and, and throughout their times I've been friends with them. All right. Well, are you excited for week one at least, taking on Mike Nolan and the Panthers? Look, I worked with Mike two years ago, so three years ago. So absolutely, Mike's, Mike, look, my wife makes the best cookies ever. <laughs> I love her cookies. Tell her, uh, if you talk to him, tell him CJ said, bring some cookies. <laughs> I'll try to get a hold of him and hold of him and let him know. That's awesome. <laughs> All right. So I'm glad that everything sounds like it's going well in Memphis, Coach. They're treating you right. The facilities are they look great on the social media. Really, really, really good treatment. I think Trey has done a phenomenal job with this with this hub and you know everything's been pretty good. I mean we had uh, some ups and downs early on, but I think so far it's getting straightened out and we, 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 we're moving in the right direction. And having the coaching staff, I like that you kept who was there and brought on kind of the guys that you knew with, you know, Quan and Garrett. I, I like that. And then the added bonus of Eric Price being there, who you already knew. Yeah, yeah. It's, it, it's, you know, these guys already had jobs. They got contracts. All these guys are good coaches, man. I researched them all. I think, I, I think the world is coaching staff. So, uh, you know, it, 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 made, it made the most sense, you know, it, it really did. I, and I had some friends 
that's pissed off at me because I didn't hire them. But I think <laughs> I got the best coaches that I can, you know, I got the best coaching staff. So it's, 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 it's going to work out well for us. I absolutely agree. I think it's going to be a great season, Coach. Uh, thank you so much for taking the time to answer my questions. I can't wait to – I'll be up there in a couple weeks. I can't wait to meet you. Perfect. That'll be perfect. I'll talk to you soon. Yes, sir. Thank you, Coach. You have a good day. I'm in the big leagues. Thunder don't miss me. Balling like Houston. Hey, feeling like Whitney. I need a bag, bruh. Selling through Quigley.